house. Joe, morning! We left it in shambles, and it's still in shambles. Meg! Did you see the look I gave the coachman at March? His impertinence! I swear, he hits every bump in the road. One should always be civil to a coachman, Amy. You must respect those who have the reins until you wrench the reins from them. Yes, young March. Joe! Marley! And remember, Amy, you're a lady now. Yes, I'm a lady. Meg! When did this house get so small? As we grow grand, the world around us often diminishes in size. I've known people to disappear before my very eyes. You're such a dear Aunt March. Thank you for everything. And I'll go see to that wretched coach. Remember, Aunt March, respect those who have the rank. Very good. Amy? Meg! Meg! Look, I'm looking at you! Thank you. 
Thank you, Joe. Joe, I never meant for it to happen like this. I always thought of Flory as yours. He was never mine. Always one of us. I brought this for you. It's a book of all my drawings. I drew everything you should have seen. All the churches and the palaces and the mountains. I want you to have them. Maybe I can't. Yes, you can. We'll be close, Joe. It'll never change. Never. Amy, thank you. Your drawings are beautiful. <laughs>